Hello guys and welcome to a Myth of Empires how-to guide. Today we're going to look at how to tame a horse. So there's a couple of things you need. You need a crude rain, you need some crude hay. We're going to craft one of them. I always recommend crafting a couple of the hays just in case because you've got to throw these out and if the horse don't go to it you've kind of wasted it. So we're going to get those crafted guys. Once they're crafted, we're going to grab them and use them. So now, first thing we need to do, we need to find a wild horse. Okay, guys, so as you can see, we have found a horse slightly ahead of us at the minute. So what we need to do, oh, there's two of them. What we need to do is we have, need to have the crude hay. Now, we don't want her to scare, i.e. run away from us. We want her to be relaxed that's why we're using the crude hay so what we need to do need to try and encourage her to go eat the crude hay and stay behind her or him once we're here as you can see it's very likely i'm going to get spotted here so whilst it's eating the crude hay we want to maneuver ourselves behind equip the reins the you got to be patient at this point. We don't want to spook her or him. It's definitely a boy. Once we're behind and we've got the crude reins in our hands, we can press E, which will mount it. Now, once we're mounting, we have to try and control it. Now, I'm going to try and get him closer to base as possible. But whilst we're mounted and we're trying to get the obedience level to go up, also the anger level is going up. So you see the anger level is actually going up a lot more than the obedience. The obedience hasn't actually moved yet. So that means he's going to be a bit of a tricky one to get to uh, be obedient and tamed. But you've got to stick at it. The horse limit is reached. You cannot gain more affection with the horses. Okay, so that's why it's not happening. So I've already got two horses. So what would be happening now is whilst the anger's going up, the obedience level would be going up. Uh, then once the obedience level is full, the horse would be tamed. Now usually when the horse... I might as well show you. Once the horse hits the full anger level, it'll try kick you off, and it gives you an opportunity to stay on, so you can keep the obedience level going up. We'll, let, we'll just get him all angry at the minute. See if we can do it. Obviously, we can't tame him because I've already got two horses at the minute, which would mean I need to level up my guild and my character so I could have more. Uh, but for purposes of the tutorial, we'll we'll go ahead and get to this bit at least. So here we're going to get a countdown where it's going to boot me off. Or we should. There we go. And it'll be a left click, right click combo. That comes up. So there you go. So if you do this combo, you see he's trying to break loose and get me off. I, I, my job is to stay on the horse so it's obedience stays up. There you go. And you just continue to do so until the obedience is full. Once the obedience is full, the horse will be tamed. Once it's tamed... You can have it to follow you, but you will need to craft a saddle. So if you go in here, you need straw rope, crude hide, and bark. So straw rope you get from grass. Crude hide you're going to have to kill either a fox, a boar, or rabbit. And bark you get from trees. Once you've done that, put the saddle on the horse and you can ride it. Hope that's helped you guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out.